I think me as a player, my main strength is probably my contested marking, so um, if that's a back, I'd like to sort of roll off an intercept or if it's forward, just try and crash packs and create a contest or whatever. And yeah, just the ability to be clean as well with my hands is probably things I pride myself on. That's the sig signature stuff for Mackenzie. Uh, courage, eye on the ball and great skill overhead. I think my year's been pretty consistent. Yeah, obviously going through three different teams has maybe been a bit of a challenge at times, but yeah, I've sort of prided myself on my ability to be consistent and show that effort throughout each team I go to, yeah. It tells everyone just to slow down and relax. It was a testament to Marcus's consistency throughout the Vic Metro Carnival that he was named his side's MVP at the end of it, ahead of the likes of Matt Rowell and Noah Anderson, both highly rated midfielders. But it was the key position player who took out that gong, and he deserved it because he's had a really consistent carnival and season playing at both ends of the ground. I expect him to be the first key position player drafted at this year's intake because of his ability to go back or his markings of great use. Then when he goes forward, he crashes packs and makes an impact there. So one of the really talented key position players in this year's pool. Looks further afield. Punch from behind's a good one. Alex Keith's one from Adelaide, who I think's yeah, been a really good player with his intercept marking. And then also, I'm a Bulldogs fan, so I love Aaron Norton. And obviously, he's a, he's a star of the game, and I'm nowhere near his level. But yeah, I guess I really aspire to sort of play like him, because he can play forward and back and impact the air at both ends. Yeah, so I was obviously a really passionate fan when I was about five years old um, with the doggies, and I'd just write letters to players um, just in my spare time. And yeah, I wrote one to Matthew Boyd, and he wasn't sort of a popular, I guess, player at the time, and he wrote back and gave me a hat and scarf, and ever since then we sort of um, became pen pals, I guess, and um, met him a few family days and that sort of thing, so yeah, that was nice. Yeah, that was a bit strange, but yeah, he did remember me from the letters, so yeah, it was a good experience as a young kid. But I guess they look up to you a lot, and he really inspired me, Matthew Boyd, so I, I guess I'd like to be an inspiration to young kids if I can get onto an AFL list. He'll drive it inside around that 50, and oh, great intercept. I find maybe I'm a bit more consistent as a defender at this stage and maybe my best foot is a forward, um, I can impact a little more. So it really depends on the club's needs as far as where they put me, yeah. You're sitting on the fence there? Yeah, I oh, am. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.